Hi, I'm Rich Torrey. Welcome to another Level Up Cartooning. We're going to go old school today, continuing our little tour through some of the incredibly popular characters and cartoons of the past. We started that tour by drawing Astro Boy. Today, we're going to draw Mighty Mouse, whose famous catchphrase was, Here I come to save the day. Mighty Mouse was an ordinary mouse with extraordinary powers, flying, super strength, and speed. How did he acquire those powers? Well, after being chased by a hungry cat into a supermarket, he happened to bathe in super soap, swallow super soup, munch super celery and plunge headfirst into an enormous piece of super cheese. And when he emerged, in a flash, he'd become Mighty Mouse. Okay. Anyways, all you need to follow along with me today is a pencil and paper. It doesn't get any easier than that, right? Before we get started, make sure you hit that thumbs up and the subscribe button as it helps this channel to grow and hit the bell so you never miss a lesson. Okay, so let's draw Mighty Mouse. <laughs> We're going to draw Mighty Mouse step by step, giving you the secret formula to be able to draw him again and again. If you've watched any of my other videos, you know I normally use the character's head to figure out how big the entire character is. In this pose, Mighty Mouse is about one and a half heads tall. In other words, however tall his head is, his entire body is one and a half of those, not counting his ears. He's also about two of those heads wide, not counting his left arm. Okay, so let's draw the roadmap for Mighty Mouse. So there's a roadmap for Mighty Mouse. Now we're on to step two. In this step, we do what I call roughing out the features. I want to remind you that until the third and final step, you want to draw as light as possible. You'll see that I use guidelines to help you to know where to put some of the character's features. We don't want those guidelines in the final drawing. So you want to draw them light enough to be able to erase them easily. So let's rough out Mighty Mouse's features.
Okay, so there are the roughed out features of Mighty Mouse. So now with the roadmap done and the features roughed out, it's time for the final step. In step three, we get to have fun. We get to draw in the final details of Mighty Mouse. We don't have to guess where to put things because we've already done all the hard work to figure that out. In this step, it's okay to draw darker, but you don't want to press too hard or mindlessly retrace over the lines you've already drawn. Always draw with an eye on tweaking and improving until the very end. So let's draw in the details for Mighty Mouse. Alrighty, there he is, Mighty Mouse. So how do you think you did? Understand, if you've never drawn Mighty Mouse before, you cannot expect to have drawn him perfectly. You notice I don't spend time coloring him during this video because I want my lesson to focus solely on the drawing process. Now you have the secret formula, the process for drawing Mighty Mouse. And with that, you can draw him again and again. And by all means, color him when you're done. I promise each time you draw him, it'll be a little better and a little easier. I also promise the more you work with me, the better you're going to get at all of your cartoon characters. For those of you who want to go a little deeper, click on the link below for my free four-part drawing series, where I spend more time explaining explaining the details and the thinking behind each step of what I call the level up cartooning process. So now I'd love to see your drawing of Mighty Mouse. If you can, take a picture and post it on either Facebook or Instagram, and don't forget to include the hashtag level up cartooning. I hope you had as much fun as I did with this one. Remember to subscribe and thanks for joining me. Until next time, keep drawing my friends.